price on the cross has just expired. His body is lit by a supernatural light. His head is inclined toward his mother, Mary, who faints in anguish, supported by St. John. and surrounded by two women. On the left, Mary Magdalene expresses her emotions by raising her hands. All the elements in this composition reinforce the dramatic nature of the scene. The expressive gestures theatrically depict a wide variety of emotion pain, incredulity, stupor, or compassion. While the diverse composition is ultimately united by the glances between the various figures. The clear, sharp colors of the generous drapery in the foreground contrast with the deathly pallor of the body of Christ detached from the dark sky. This crucifixion is the most original and perhaps the most moving of all those made by Simone Volwe, painter to King Louis XIII. After a long stay in Italy, Voe established himself in Paris in 1627, where he became one of the greatest French decorators of his time. As the leader of a large workshop comprised of numerous assistants, Voe was patronized by the most illustrious members of French society. In 1636, he produced an ambitious decor for the chapel of the private mansion of the Chancellor, Pierre Segier. The three pieces presented on the wall, the crucifixion in the center, the Last Supper on the left, and the incredulity of St. Thomas on the right, all belong to this ensemble. Crucifixion was shown above the master altar of the chapel. 